peso do metal reúne mais de 20 mil pessoas no Monsters of Rock, como foi o show siderado do Scan. Oi, eu sou a Cris Couto com o MTV no ar. No último sábado, a cidade de São Paulo foi palco de uma verdadeira maratona de heavy metal, o Philips Monsters. Em suas 14 horas de duração, passaram pelo palco do festival duas bandas nacionais e sete estrangeiras. Mais de 20 mil pessoas foram até a pista de atletismo do Ibirapuera, deixando até o veterano Tom Maraia, o baixista e vocalista do Slayer, meio nervoso na hora de subir no palco. A gente convidou o Gastão, especialista no assunto, para falar com as bandas. A gente vai dar o melhor que puder Porque, para falar a verdade, a maioria das pessoas Que vai estar no festival Nem conhece o Dorsal Direito Apesar de 15 anos de estrada Esse set a gente vai tocar aquilo que, é, que Nós já gravamos, aquilo que é de melhor da gente Durante esses 13, 14 anos Que a gente tem na carreira Vamos tocar os as melhores músicas Todo mundo gosta Pro show pra galera You chose some some songs of Deep Purple, Trapeze, Hughes and Troll. How did you play like your own stuff? I think I gotta play more of a heavy show, but even my heavy show isn't that fucking heavy. Although Deep Purple basically created heavy metal, we weren't a fucking heavy metal band. So, you know, we played a hard rock set today. I think most of the people liked it. This is our like this is our fourth gig in Brazil, so we, play, we uh, find ourselves very lucky to be here in such a big festival with not to be here. And we love the Brazilian fans so much; they're so great, and they and they like us, and, and you know, and they really made us feel very welcome. And we want to say obrigado. Hey, if I'd like to, to bring some bands to play in a festival, which bands do you think that could be like the perfect view for a for a band? Saxon? <laughs> What do you think that's happening with metal? Do you think that's coming back to becoming a trendy? Yeah, I, I, I think it's coming back. It's, I don't think it's I don't think it's too trendy because when it gets trendy, it goes bad. It has to be heavy metal, you know. This was uh, the first show we did on the Infinity Tour was here, and now tonight, uh, tomorrow's show will be the last. And and even though it's been a year, I think uh, the shows we did here a year ago stood out as one of the highlights for the whole tour. What's the sensation just before the key? Because you're about to come on the stage. What's the sensation? There's only one sensation when you're in Brazil. Loco, loco, totally fucking crazy. Everybody out there is fucking insane for heavy metal. <laughs> Agora você confere uma matéria com as duas atrações mais importantes do festival, o Slayer e o Megadeth do ex-metálica Dave Mustaine. Você tem so many álbuns, LPs. É difícil para você escolher o right song? Às vezes, é como se você olhar e você vê 100 mulheres maravilhosas e você tem que escolher qual você quer. You think of which women you did last night in the other city, and then you choose different ones in the new city. Same with songs. Do you care about playing in festivals? Do you, do you mind, or it's okay for you to have like a short, a reduced time to play? Well, it, it's better to play in front of a lot of people and, and have uh, a, a lot of fun than it is to play uh, for a long time in front of a little amount of people and, and not having fun. And festivals, you can have a lot of fun because you see a lot of the other bands that are in the same type of musical genre that we're in. You know, some of the bands that are on, on tonight's bill um, were making records before I was born, but... Um... <laughs> a lot of people say, oh, Dave is not an easy going person, I have to tell them. But you're such a nice guy. Well, I, I, either they're lying or I got you fooled. Away, away! And they've been a beast! You had like a, an autograph session in a shopping center. How was that? Crazy. <laughs> Very mean, crazy. Crazy. They were screaming and yelling. And uh, they had like they had like all these guys in suits, all security, all lined up front. 
Yeah. <laughs> First time they played, there were like 30,000, 35,000 people. Do you still get nervous after all these years? Like, not at all, man. I mean, I just I'm fidgety, but I don't get nervous. I mean, this is what I do. You know, it's like my job. Um, you know, you just warm up. Walk on the stage, say, I know I'm going to own this stage for the next hour and a half, and all you fucks out there are going to like it. A MTV gravou todos os shows do Philips Monsters. Eles vão ao ar logo mais numa série especial do programa Alto e Bom Som.